Hi, I'm Matt the Common Guy, and today I want to explain about. Well, it's another thing about Five Nights at Red Yes, Another one of these videos. But I want to mention one thing in the most recent game in the series, Help Wanted 2. Specifically, a certain theory about it, but. We're not getting to that point of the video yet. I just want to say, at first, well, your support. Well, how many subscribers I had. Well, this channel, I will never have any subscribers. So thanks for subscribing. And make sure you subscribe for more. Anyway. Now. I have explained many length and how I thought about certain theories in this series, especially this newer one. And this is a theory I had coming better than any other one. See, the Hemp Wanted to Protagonist is revealed to be well, the father of the previous main protagonist in the previous release, Ruin. The real negotiator of security breach, which is Cassie. That's right, Cassie's dad is the help wanted to protect main protagonist. That's not all. What I want to say this is the fact that. There's a certain thing in the game, canon-wise and timeline-wise, that should that should have been explained. So you had a couple characters in this game returning, just like the first have wanted. You got Fay Fazbear himself in his grandma form, obviously. Roxanne Wolf, the stat box, the daycare attendant. And, of course, help me. But there's one animatronic that should have been in this game, and unfortunately he is. So, this is level in the game, where you help, uh, help, help me. Uh, help, help me, and, of course... You had to survive against a couple animatronics. Pick patch, yes. But also this topic of today's video. That's right. It's the thing. It's this it's this thing character with green eyes. That's right, we're talking about one of the characters that has one of the animatronics that had been destroyed in Pizza Day Simulator, but suddenly then return in this game. We're talking, we're talking about this dark colored Freddy lookalike. In case you don't know what I'm talking about, Lefty was one of the characters from Pizza Day Simulator. And I gotta ask if this is supposed to take place after root sometime after security breach, then why is he here? Lefty, surprise, surprise, is the puppet. Yes. So here's my experience. I find an explanation of this game, and I'm sure you understand. I believe that this game is a mirrored representation of what happened previously in the timeline. That's my guess, but that this still doesn't explain why Lefty is here. Why is he here? I don't know, but. I'm sure you guys have an answer in the comments. First of all, Lefty, aka the puppet, 
puppet was destroyed in Pizza Ray Simulator at the end of the game when the whole place was set on fire. I don't know what this happened, but, and second of all, did we already establish that animatronics controlled by humans shouldn't exist in the story at all? Or anymore? Was that resolve in Happiness Day? Oh, and I got to mention, the V. The thing I got to mention the most, biggest problem in this game and help in this game, Princess Quest. Yes, there is a thing in this game called Princess Quest. In case you don't know, the first Help Wanted, you know, the flat loan version, had a mini game called Princess Quest and Security Breach brought it back. That's why. It's not just Lefty returning in this game that's the big problem. It's also a fact and how a certain theory ruined a certain theory ruined what was the point of Princess Quest. In case you don't know, there was a theory out there when Security Breach released. It had a thought that Golden Cassidy, aka the character that controlled Golden Freddy, was the princess. And this, in that mini game, was is the reason why Matt Pat wouldn't understand that that Golden Freddy story in the games is already over. In case you don't know, he's the one that made the theory, and he's the one that decided to have other people decide and thinking that Golden Freddy stories continue on into this new line of games, but not really. In fact, there is an explanation on Google and how this happened. It says here over and over again that Happiest Day was the end of Golden Freddy's story and that there was no more Golden Freddy. That's why you don't see him anywhere, besides what Matt Pat said, anywhere in Help Wanted, Security Breach, it's real in DLC, or in this game. This game, mini game is, this mini game called Princess Quest is the reason why going people thinking that Golden Freddy is still around in the series in the story of the series has made it much worse. Reason number one is being the fact that people already had said this before. Yeah, I made a video about it. Reason number two is that just like Lefty returning in this game, it doesn't explain anything and how it could happen. Reason number three is because they saw that there's been a rare chance of certain animatronics returning into this series to show that their part of the story isn't done. Reason number four is this shows that anything can work with their people's theories. Reason number five, it's just the same thing I've been knowing for for many years about these theorists. Matt Pack made a video called Why People Don't Like His Theories. Well, is is using certain information. Well, did she realize that's using certain information that doesn't make sense? Could kind of, could actually help 100% prove that your theories 
ignore evidence, should ignoring, should avoiding certain facts, should should be reasonable enough to count as ignoring evidence. Should any evidence that goes against what certain things should happen should be considered annoying evidence? Yes. Should certain things that feel like certain things are confirmed to not be true is annoying evidence? Yes. And should all those things deserve of why people don't like your theories? Yes. Reason number six is biggest reason of why of why people don't like theories is that you think of certain things in this series that don't make sense anymore. You are the one that are continuing continuing used to continue and hopefully will not continue thinking that Golden Freddy is still around in the story of the series even though it's been proved it's been not. My special delivery. And of course you are the one who says yes Gregory was a robot. You also so are the reason why these two problems in these two things in this games are the reason why are the reason why they exist. Princess Quest exists in this game and somehow Lefty. Oh, and also a reminder, somehow Scrap Baby is part of that main game. And Funtime Freddy. And any other character that shouldn't exist in the game, even, even other characters that I haven't mentioned in the game, somehow do exist in the story of this game somehow, but should not. In, special, in reason number seven, special delivery is the one that started. The first help wanted was the one that started this. That's right. It continue on returning characters into the story while well, any explanation, even though it should that the end of their story, really their actual end of the story, could confirm that there should not be there. And then special delivery came along and look what had happened. It returned Golden Freddy. Even though in the story the game should happen after Golden Freddy's story is over. And now we're seeing and then now this game is doing it. It's because of you of you fearless. You're the ones that are making these developers doing this. So, please, why I ask, be careful of what you say in your theories. And don't continue on theorizing about certain things in games that have already been savage to be over. Okay, I'm done with this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. I'm Matt the Comic Guy. Like, share, and subscribe. If you want to watch any other videos that are related to this, links down below. I, I will see you in the next video. Bye.